What's up guys, Brennan3 here, bringing you a gameplay and commentary on Kowloon. First strike, map pack, I've got it. And I decided I might as well do a video on it, even though I'm not playing Black Ops very often. This is actually the second game that I've got since being black, being back on Black Ops. And map pack came out, what, like last week? I haven't played it since last week, so just a, the first game. This is what I got. It seems though that the it kind of la it's got this little bit of lag. This gameplay, I don't know. It just theater mode was for me, and you know I couldn't I didn't couldn't figure it out. And I thought it was a decent gameplay. I didn't really want to continue playing the game any more than I was. So you know I apologize for that. If you kind of think it just looks wrong, it's not flowing smoothly. That's what my concerns about this. Just the uh, how it turned out, but oh well. Um, I'm using like one of my sub accounts. You know, I've me and my friend Quasar ninety five. We made these little clown accounts that we called it. And we mucked around, and you know, I went on went on it just to rush with a MP five K of going lightweight marathon slide of hand, which I think is probably the best class for rushing. You know, and Kowloon probably not the best map in the world to rush I think most people do tend to camp on it and but overall I just like the environment I like what this map has to offer it's lots of buildings lots of you know the zip lines awesome and there's lots of these little areas where you, where you can go and there's you probably discover more about more and more more and more new things about the map as you go on you know, you're gonna discover these little corners and little areas that you've probably never seen before as you keep playing the map and as things progress. My, you know, like I said, my biggest thing about it is is that most people are gonna, you know, stay in the buildings and just camp. And that's what I've seen so far, especially in like Search and Destroy, even though that is like the camping, the biggest camping game mode. But even like in Team Deathmatch, there's a lot of camping going on, and that's why I just wanted to do a marathon lightweight kind of gameplay. Even though, yes, I am using an SMG, and probably wouldn't put up a video of me play playing with the SMG, but that's all I really had. It was either this or the Enfield on this, and I was just playing for fun, and I got a decent gameplay, so I thought, alright, let's just upload it, and we'll have something new to at least talk about. First Strike as a whole, well... I'm. I think it's all right. It, I'm not overly impressed, but it's probably better than what Modern Warfare 2 map packs were. So, but is it worth the money? No, not really. It's twenty-two dollars ninety-five in Australia. That's ridiculous. I can't believe that we have to pay that much, and our and our dollar is actually higher than America. So you know, that's that's stupid. But oh well. That's just life. We got a pretty lucky care package here. And I know, watching back, that guy's hiding there that whole time. And I didn't even see him. I wasn't even paying attention. I was just just looking around and, and waiting for my care package to drop. And there you go. The guy snuck in there the whole time and just sat there waiting for me to pop out. And lucky I still got... Lucky I didn't actually have my death machine fully pulled out. Otherwise, I wouldn't get to use it. That would have been a bit of a shame. Death Machine, it kind of like ruined me because you couldn't run sprint with it. So um, I, the whole time I was like running and running and running with with the MP5K. And then I get the Death Machine, I got to slowly move around the map. <laughs> so I wasn't getting around as fast as I wanted to. So that was a big thing for me. But Death Machine, if you get it, you know, you just, you can't really lose with it. It's so dominant, so good. It's just the ultimate weapon. This guy, he must be an AFK. I must have got him about five times. So easy. Easy kills. Love it. Um, My favorite first strike map is probably Berlin Wall because... Well, it's... I just think it suits more my gameplay. You know, I'm not always on the move, but I can take up a building and, you know, pretty much... If I have a building where I can see many parts of the maps, and there's one building that I particularly like, and just kill 
and you know work up my kill streaks if I'm trying to play properly. That's what I can do on Berlin Wall. Whereas Kowloon is kind of difficult for me at times. Um, Stadium, I 50-50 games. And Discovery, I hate on every single game mode except for Search and Destroy. And I don't even like it that much on Search and Destroy. And that was a shame that I finally died with the Death Machine. I was enjoying using that. Don't get it very often. That's probably about the third time I've ever gotten one. And probably the longest I've ever survived with on it as well. So it was, it was good to get one. Um, coming to a close of this gameplay. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'm going to try get some more gameplays. I'm going to try. I'm going to try my hardest to force myself to play Black Ops. And get some more gameplays done for you guys. So 19 to 4. Not too bad. See you guys later.